If you need to work with an attachment, create or send one, there are several connectors that support that. Don't be confused by what you see now. Simple Trigger is not one of them, but I'm using it here to send some information along the flow. Now, what I'm really looking for is the CSV connector, and here I'm using it to create, or in fact, write a CSV file as an attachment. Here I prefer to have some headers, so I have to enter them manually. You can define the headers however you want to. Here I want to fetch some information from the previous step, hence this choice of headers. Now this is where I choose what information I want to fetch. The default configuration of the simple trigger doesn't provide many parameters to choose from, but in your case it could be, for example, all the necessary customer data such as full name, email address, company address, and so on. As a next step, I want to get this attachment. One of the connectors to do that is email. Other examples include Microsoft OneDrive, Dropbox, SFTP, and Amazon S3 connectors. The email connector has a few required fields marked with red asterisks, so I need to fill out those fields to proceed. Now let's publish our draft and start the flow. As you can see, I received my attachment in my inbox, as expected.